and welcome to this video. So today we're going to be checking out Kingdom Come Deliverance on the Steam Deck. Now, as always, I'm using Steam Link to record the screen of the Steam Deck, which kind of gets confusing sometimes, but that's what I'm doing. So I'm basically streaming the screen to my PC to record the game, and it does subtract from the performance a tiny bit. But I do play the game without the Steam, using the Steam Link so I can see the... The performance of the game without the Steam Link affecting it. Now, some games aren't really affected, but some games are if they if games like Cyberpunk and Red Dead Redemption that use more resources tend to suffer in performance when using the Steam Link or Steam Remote Play, whichever one you want to do. I mean, Steam Link, Steam Remote Play, basically whatever you want to call it, it's, it's basically the same thing. I'm just streaming the screen from the Steam Deck to my PC whatever you want to call it. Anyways, as of making this video, the Kingdom Come Deliverance is currently not supported on the Steam Deck, or at least that's what it says when I downloaded. Well, it didn't, it actually said unknown, so it wasn't verified, it didn't say playable, it just said unknown, so I downloaded it anyway because, well, I just wanted to try it, and in my mind, I really wasn't expecting this game to work. I mean, this game is super hard to run at times, depending on your settings. I mean, even at medium settings, it's still kind of hard to run, in my opinion. This game, no matter what, it, it I mean, it looks great, and it's kind of hard to run. But, I launched the game, and to my surprise, the game actually launched, because I didn't even think it would launch, to be honest with you. And then, the default settings for the game were all on medium, and I didn't change anything, except for I turned motion blur off, that was the only setting that I changed and I also increased the FOV only two settings I changed but they really don't change how the game looks they're just kind of preferences I would say so I kept the settings all at, at medium and I launched the game I click continue I'm not really sure I haven't played this game in forever I'm not really sure where I was ended up at being basically at the beginning of the game so I just wandered around at the beginning part of the game and to my surprise, this game ran pretty well. It ran way better than I ever expected it to run on the Steam Deck. I mean, I had this game on all medium settings, and I also had the resolution at 1280 by 800, which is the highest resolution that the Steam Deck can go because it's its native resolution. And this game was almost hitting 60 frames per second almost all the time. Now, when I was playing with using the Steam Deck to record the screen, well, the game would drop into the 40s, but when I was just playing on the Steam Deck, didn't have to worry about the Steam Link or Steam Remote Play or any of that. The game ran at mostly 50 frames, 50 plus frames per second, almost reaching 60 at times. It was crazy. And at the 1280 by 800 native resolution and the medium settings, this game still looked great on the Steam Deck. Now, later on in the game, I would have to play the game for a while to get at later at this point. But later on, there are these like towns or uh, cities or they're basically, I, I remember one, it's like they're basically castles. And then there's like the town inside the castle. I'm not really sure what to call it, but I know those areas are much more difficult to run but I'm sure you're going to get at least 30 frames per second basically at all times on medium settings because the game almost ran at 60 frames per second in the beginning area and I'm thinking worst case scenario if you go into those towns it might half your frame rate sometimes possibly and again that's just a chance that could happen because those towns tend to lo have lower frame rates than the rest of the map uh, I'm thinking worst case scenario, maybe half your frame rate, and so you'll be getting like 30 to 35 frames per second, which is still good for the Steam Deck. I mean, honestly, I'm just kind of surprised that the game ran and was able to be played on medium settings because I was about to lower all the settings to the lowest, and it ran this well. I mean, they need to take that unknown away from the game and give it a verified playable rating because this game, I just verified, it is 100% playable on the Steam Deck and you can definitely have a good time and enjoy playing this game anyways that's gonna be it for this video so I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to hit that like button leave a comment below tell me did you guys think kingdom come deliverance would be running this well on the steam deck or would run at all on the steam deck let me know in the comments below and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button because you want to be subscribed and I'll see you guys next time